Yo, it's your boy K A N E, aka the Whiskey Boss. What's going on, people? Happy Thirsty Thursday. Welcome back. Welcome back. Welcome back, man. How's everybody doing, man? Um, peace, man. Love. Salute to all my my whiskey drinkers, man. To everybody, man. Love and blessings, man. Goes out, spread around the world. You know what I'm saying? Uh, we blessed to be here another day. So uh, let's jump right into it, man. The whiskey boss chooses Erza B. Ezra, Ezra B. Now, if y'all can see the bottle, let's see if y'all can see that I've been, uh, had quite some time to give this a great tasting. Um, I'll show y'all the price, if y'all can see that. $25.99, $25.99. Um, this is a 99 proof, 49.5 alcohol, yeah, 99 proof. Uh, they wrote the barrel number on here, and this is single barrel. This is age 12 years, uh, single barrel Kentucky straight bourbon whiskey, man. Now, um, I don't recall seeing this often, and did some research, and there's a reason why. Um, this is basically it. This is the last of the last of the... Era, 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 I'm sorry for uh, mispronouncing it, um, Ezra B, this is the last of the last, May, basically they didn't stop making these, man, they, uh, the, the single barrel blue wax joint, they stopped making these, so, I didn't know that at the time, you know, to, to after I bought it, and, I, and that made me feel a little more better. Like, man, you know, I got something that, that's discontinued. So, um, yeah, is it, is it, is, it, is it, the main thing is, is it worth it? What kind of will me in about it is it's a single barrel. I love single barrel. Most most single barrels from uh, companies. Um, one that I don't care too much is Jim Beam, as everybody know, single barrel. I think uh, it's a shame on them for even calling that a single barrel, but uh, yeah, it's single barrel. Most of the time, I like it, so let's jump right into it, man. Here it is, man. This, this is the dinosaur, man. This is finna be extinct, and actually, um, well, I'll get into that a little later. Y'all know how I usually do it, man. I'm gonna uh, nose it. I'm going to give you the color texture, taste it, rate it, suggest it. Will I buy it again and all that good stuff, man? So let me go start start with the nose. Y'all can see the color right now, though. It's a pretty color. Pretty, pretty, pretty. But let me nose it. I'm getting a lot of sweetness off this. I'm getting like a uh, sweet corn. A little sugar, like a little burnt brown sugar note. A fruit note. Nose is, is 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 excellent, man. I uh I like the nose. Let me see. Do I in this bottle I have? I can't really smell the barrel. I'm not really getting a, a deep barrel smell uh, for it to be a 12 year old. But this, this like I said, it could be just this batch that I have. Uh, all right, color texture. I'm gonna give that a uh. Dark gold. Yeah, I'm, I'm gonna give it a dark gold. So, here it is, man. The moment we all been waiting on. Happy Thirsty Thursday again. Um, this is it, man. Like, these, they stopped, they discontinued these bottles. So, if y'all see some, if you happen to see some, even if, uh, you know, you might not like it. You might just want to grab it and throw it on your bar, man, because it's 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 it's, it's rare, man. This is it. So happy thirsty Thursday. We made it another week. God bless. Cheers. And here it goes.
Okay. Ezra B. Single barrel. Age 12 years. When you first sipping it, you're getting you're getting that 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 sweet palate that 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 sweet like a rush of um of sweetness like uh some candy you're getting that you do get the barrel taste um it finishes i'm gonna say medium it finishes medium um the hundred proof well close to hundred proof is there i i taste that um Y'all know the whiskey boss, man. The whiskey boss likes the 120 proof, the 130 proof, the the the, the proof where people look at it and, and, and say, "Hey, man!" Before they drink it, you know that's 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 what I love, man. But this is not bad. This is not bad. Uh, <clears throat> let me let me give another taste. It's a decent sipper, man. It's it's it's, it's decent. Um, you're getting, you're getting some great stuff, man. Like, it's, 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 it's a heaven, it's heaven hill product. So it's under the heaven hill, well, it was under the heaven hill umbrella. Um, I'm tasting a little cocoa too in there, man. Hmm. I like it, man. Um, it finishes medium. The flavor is there. But the flavor is not a long, it, uh, the flavor doesn't run its course long. Um, but you get like, like that little flavor and then, then the spice kicks in. Um, hmm. I like it though. I like it. Uh, it's, it's, I like it. You get, you get the flavor, the spice, and then the burl. That's what you get. Age twelve years. I like it. Um, <clears throat> if I had to compare this to something or put it in a ring with something, I would have to probably most likely put it in a ring with Wild Turkey One on One. Um, yeah, I, I would have to. Now, if I had to choose between Wild Turkey and this, <clears throat> Wild Turkey One on One and this. Um, ooh, that's close, man. That that'd be a good fight to watch, man. Wild Turkey one on one and the Ezra B single barrel. Uh, me personally, I think the Wild Turkey one on one flavor matches better. You know, the flavor runs, of course, better than this. And plus, you get a hundred one on one proof, which I love. Like I said, more proof. But this is good, man. This this. This it would be no knockouts in that ring between this Ezra B single barrel and the uh, Wild Turkey one on one. It would be no KO, man. But uh, Kane, aka the Whiskey Boss, got to rate Ezra B single barrel. This is it, man. This is a dinosaur right here. I got, man. Um, I'm gonna have to go pick up a few more bottles, man. Um, I'm gonna have to. I'm, I'm gonna have to. Since this is it. I'm gonna have to. I believe the liquor store. It was two more bottles left. Um, that was earlier than the week. So uh, hopefully they still there. A lot of people probably still sleep on it. But Kane, aka the Whiskey Boss, I gotta give Ezra B Single Barrel, hmm, twelve years. I gotta give this. Okay, but then the price plays a part, a part too with with him. Um, is is twenty five dollars under thirty dollars? Ooh, man. I'm going to have to give this. Yeah, I'm going to have to give it this, man. 7.5 out of a 10, man. I, I got to give it a 7.5. I, I was on the fence of giving it an 8. I really am because of the price. is under $30. Um, but to me, an 8 is, is man, an 8 is up there with... with <clears throat> Excuse me. Uh, eight is up there with the big dogs, with my big dogs, what I love. 
Aiden's up there with my wild turkey rare breeder. Aiden's up there with 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 the stag. I mean, you know, stag more to me. I believe I rated that a nine point five or a nine, but it's in that heavyweight, and I can't put this in 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 that class. I cannot put this in that class with my stag and rare breed wild turkey. Um, but it's great. It's is is it's a nice sipper. It gives you the strength. Uh, it gives you the sweet taste. It gives you the spice. I like it, man. I like it. And for the price, I, I like it, man. So, I suggest this for everyone, man. Everyone, I'm kind of uh, skeptical about rookies, but I think rookies should, 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 should try it. If y'all should see it, try it, man, because you, 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 you're drinking a classic right now, man. You know, you, you're drinking what some people would consider the classic. Some people hate it. Some people like it. I mean, it's, it's rare. Get it. Put it in your bar. Sip on it. Let me know what y'all think. And for those that taste it, let me know what y'all think. Um, and that's pretty much it, man. Uh, I suggest this for everybody, man. I I, I, I really do. Um, and that's it, man. So, see y'all next Thursday, Thursday. Man, we did another work week. Y'all see, it's about time for me to unwind now, man. Rough day, but I did it. Me and Ezra B going to get the rest of the night right. <laughs> I like it, man. I think I think a 7.5 is a good rating for me, man. Like I said, I can't I can't put it up there with 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 the heavyweights, but it's almost there. This is this I would consider this sort of like a middleweight. Middleweight, not heavyweight yet, man. But that's my review, man. See y'all next Thursday, Thursday, man. Peace, love, man. Hey, stay safe, man, and, and, and can't wait to see y'all next Thursday, for real. Oh, shots.